deception is a very difficult thing in human society because deception has you know many many roots but it strikes at what we need in society and that is trust the ancient greeks uh, had the concept of the persona the masks and we put on masks in various ways because i don't think that anybody that uh, steps outside of an incredibly protective cocoon can help but uh, be hurt at various times that we're hurt in a variety of ways because as we move from egotism to being able to be other-centered, um, it's, a, it's a bumpy road, a really bumpy road. And so we don't want to be hurt. And so in this instance, I will put on this mask to avoid being hurt. But the idea of a persona is to say, well, wait a second, if I wish to achieve something, then the only way I think I can achieve it is to be that type of person or this type of person. Whether I am innately that type of person is a different matter. So it's something that we do, I think, in terms of survival, and also because we're not brave. If people are brave, they say, well, this is who I am. This is the drive towards an integrated personality, an integrated person. What does it mean to be a whole person? It means to be able to bring these various personas or types together to be able to be one type, one person. God calls us to be whole. And when we are whole, we're then at peace. We don't have this warring within ourselves. We build on trust. And trust is something that we have to be able to instill in people with honesty. It was said in the English boarding schools that being an upright man is doing the right thing even when nobody's looking, even when nobody's going to check up on you because you have actually internalized the good. If you want to take the Greek principle, you've internalized the good. And the good is to be able to, to have what you say be truthful. And, and we would say that bearing truth, not just bearing false witness, but bearing truth is a positive because it builds up a healthy community, whether that is only a community of friends whether that's a community of family or whether that's a broader community. So that, as Jesus he said himself, let your yes be yes and your no be no. People will lie to get what they should not have, okay? They will lie to get out of situations, lie because of shame, you know? Uh, of course, it's understandable that people lie, but it's, when is it really a good thing? Speaking as a moral theologian, um, it's never a good thing to lie, but you're not always... Uh, a, you're not always impelled to tell everybody the complete truth. You have a right to truth. However, no one has a right to all your information. Even though people are incredibly intrusive and demanding of information, you don't have a duty to tell them all the information unless they have a right to have it from you. Okay? So you normally have a duty to tell your